it's not it's not like that expensive but yeah get somebody who knows and okay that sounds like i'm doing advertising for myself it could be anyone who knows what he's doing but get somebody who knows what he's doing will get you the product to the spec you want tell them tell them the story because that's another thing that that i have troubles with that they, they give me a trailer they give me a couple of Im images and i don't know what the story is about and then you know the audience anything right yeah then you end up with a video of a psycho killing people and it's not really like your story. A romantic comedy yeah it's a, it's I, a rom -com, but yeah it's fucking, fucking um, gay. Yeah, you know, having a clear-cut plan and communicating that mm -hmm. with the people that you're working with. But one of the uh, tips I've given, I give to everybody, is when you commission artwork, mm -hmm. don't think of that art as just being a cover or a print. Think about what else you can put it on. Can I make this a blanket? Can I make this? On, can I put this on a cup? Can I make it, this a sticker? This think looks of, like it could be a poster. Yeah, uh -oh, think wait. of ways that you can reutilize that artwork. Mm -hmm. Same way with the animation that you pay for. Mm -hmm. Same way with your trailers. Because it's yours at the yeah. end of the day. Like Fine. I'm not gonna be. I'm, I, if I animate something for you and you reuse it, I'm gonna say, "Hey, wait a minute!" Like, dude, like you had you commissioned for a job. Mm -hmm. I did it for you. It's yours. So it's well, that, and that speaks there. to like when you talk about making a trailer that's under sixty seconds. Like, great, mm -hmm. you've the short is already ready. Then mm -hmm. it's, it might just be a reconform. Yep. But you already have a short. So now mm -hmm. you can put it into a whole other category that's super popular right now. Yeah. Yeah. There's all kinds of stuff that you can do.